Hey, y'all see LaMelo versus Trey? Yeah, I seen it. You who, don't know who won. Battle of the best PGs in the in the East? Couple? Yeah, that was a hell of a game. I Give think me LaMelo. Nah. Give me your take. I think Trey <laughs> Young, man. I think DeJounte leaving, even though they said they was cool, they was friends, they had a good relationship, whatever that is. But him getting the ball back in his hand, and he know mm-hmm. he can just be himself. Ain't got to worry about pleasing somebody else on the balls, like making sure somebody else is happy on the court. I think we tapping him to that that MVP candidate, Trey. You know what I mean? Whoa. Nah, seriously. I mean, the, the Hawks go as far as he go. So, sure. if he having moments like he been having, <clears throat> shit, he going to be in the run for MVP. I don't know why he gets so much hate. Um, I, I really don't. I mean, I get you may not have to like him, but as far as a player, yeah, he don't play defense, but he puts up stats. And I think maybe that's the beef, but Trey Young been cold. And no, Addy think, kicked in. I'm Michael Jackson, but I'm my well, father. I think it's the uh, Steph Curry comparison and then the Luka draft. Like, yeah. getting traded for Luka, I think that shit kind of hurt him. You know, not hurt him, but, like, people look and see what Luka doing, how far his team is going, all that shit. It kind of be like, damn. But what's fucked up about it is, until last year, he had dang near went farther than him where the same amount because he got yeah. to the Eastern Conference Finals. Nah, I'm tapped in with Trey. I yeah, know. You know. Like, uh, I know he made it to the Eastern Conference Finals. We played him. So, I know what he's capable of. I know what kind of teammate he is. I know what kind of player he is. People just don't seem to like that, his style of play. I think they think it's like a knockoff of Steph Curry, <clears throat> but I think he didn't carve his own lane. They treat him like they do James Harden when he was with the Rockets down there. Yeah. Yeah, like, no matter what you do number-wise, you still, we have a stigma of how we view you, and that's how we just going to label you. Nah, yeah. And LaMelo, shit, I, I love to see him kill. Love to see him bounce back after, you know what I'm saying, last year's disappointing injuries. They weren't that good, but he's he cemented himself to let people know he really liked that for real. He better than me. Yeah, so you'd rather have LaMelo? Yeah. I think a lot of people would rather have LaMelo just maybe because of the age difference. I don't think it's that much off, but. Nah, Trey, Trey Young. a killer, though. I Trey Young a But if player. I had to pick, I'm taking, I'm taking LaMelo, bro. LaMelo ain't won nothing. Like, he ain't led his team to nothing. No man, hate on LaMelo. Just, man, he just got there. I mean, how long we going to keep saying he just got there? Trey did that shit in five years. He been, he Damn, he only years. been to year three, nigga. That's LaMelo's nah, fifth year. Nah. He on Max deal. LaMelo yeah. ain't been in the league five years, bro. Bro, this is year four or five. We could be wrong. I thought five this, years is crazy. It's though. a mellow fifth year because rookie year he had rookie year, and then second year he, he got drafted twenty twenty. Yeah, yeah, it's four. Because he was an all star second year. Yeah, you don't see man. But Trey had a better team. Ah, uh, uh, bro, we did crash out Ben and Coos in Charlotte, bro. <laughs> Touche. Come on, bro. Like, I ain't damn. saying bro. the organization a little bit structured a little bit different. Yeah, I ain't saying he ain't, but I just think the production Trey Young gives and the production that Lamelo. Yeah, I think Trey Young give you more, but I like Lamelo though. Trey a unicorn though. It's hard getting a guard that small though with that type of production. Yeah. They ain't even drafting motherfuckers that small no more. Mm-mm. So nah. I don't get it. Because I they because <clears throat> early on they try to give Sharif Cooper like that capability, but then they gave him a knock because of his size too. It's like you said. I still it, think Sharif Cooper can play in the NBA. I think he can too, but I think it's a different conversation rather than he can just play. Also, I don't know if he can guard the NBA. I think that might be I mean the league changing though. He can't guard. But yeah, people I guess like that's Trey what it is. Young and Darius Garland, they they unicorns for sure. Most definitely. Shout out to Darius Garland, man. One of the most underrated PGs in the NBA. Like, I know he gets his – but Darius Garland is cold at basketball, and people don't speak on it enough. He got a lot to prove this year, though. Yeah, it's about time for him to take that next step. It's like he he made the all-star team, and he started, like, teetering back and forth. And it's like, bro, you're going to have to either go up or you're going to be, you know, middle of the pack PG. Mm -hmm. Because it's a lot of great PGs. Hardest position in basketball. Yeah, for sure. And I think – he in the middle of the pack right now, but he got a chance and opportunity to make himself, solidify himself as top 10 for sure. Yeah. Do you feel like if he was in a different situation, we wouldn't be having this conversation? Nah, he in the perfect situation. I mean, yeah. mm. he only other person you got to worry about is Donovan. Everybody else says screens. You got Mobley, says mm-hmm. screens. They working on his offense. Yeah, Straight Allen said screens. And the only person you got to worry about is Donovan Mitchell, and he can't shoot every shot. I mean, he'll try, but not everyone. You can easily average. 24 on that team. Easy. Yep. Hmm. Like That's true, easy. bro. I and I agree. Think, I think Kenny's a coach that will put him in that position yeah, too yeah, as well. Yeah, I think he's going to have a great year. But, like, the opportunity he got, like, point guard's dream. 
Like that's a dream. Yeah, y'all supposed to be working out like Luca and Kyrie working out. Yeah, that's a dream situation. Like yeah. I would have loved to been like in a situation like that. For sure. Make a lot of sense. A bunch of big dudes that's gonna set screens and some I ain't demanding the ball. And I ain't gonna say uh the other players are average, but well Max Max Struess is a shooter. Yeah. George Niang shooter. Karis Levert mm-hmm. gonna get it off the Karis dribble anyway. Levert, yeah, he gonna do his thing. But Wade shooter. Mm-hmm. You just got shooting and bigs, and you got another guard that y'all just take turns really. So For nah, sure. I agree with that. Yeah, I, I feel like like you said, it's definitely time for him to make the mark. He got paid too, so he might be a little comfortable, but I think yeah. it's definitely time for him, you know what I'm saying? Make some noise again, show people who he is. Yeah, facts. Speaking of college basketball, um, you know what I'm saying? That's coming back too. People, I ain't heard a lot of noise right outside of the Cooper Flash situation. Um, we got Rutgers. They got the two young stars in there that's gonna go crazy. Yeah. Yeah. But I watched I, a uh preseason game. Yeah, they practice game. Yeah. St. John's. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the they, two young boys, nice. Ron Harper's son, cold, bro. Yeah, nice. I can see him. I honestly could see him being the number one pick. I mean, you're not gonna pick him number one because of Cooper Flag, because of what, everything that come with him. And uh, you know, just being honest, he's the great white hope. You yeah. know what I mean? Come on, man. Athletic white dude like that got potential to be a star, or whatever. But Ace Bailey got so much potential to be a star <laughs> and Harper. Ace like, he the one. Ace Bailey cold. He the one. Buddy. Ace Bailey cold, yeah, bro. He the, one. He he the best remind, player in college basketball to me. He okay, got that. He got yeah. that Brandon Miller type of game, mm-hmm. like that Paul George mode with Brandon mm-hmm. Miller type game. Uh, he got the ability to be a superstar in the NBA. Um, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he got picked before Cooper, but I mean, like I said, we know why. It wouldn't make sense, but yeah, it's yeah. deep in the rap. Yeah, I think it's fire. That they both wear Adidas. I mean, they both wear Nikes at Adidas school. Like in practice, that's fire. Yeah. <laughs> Cooper flag so raw though. Like I get it, you know he gonna get the pass because you know what I mean he the other tone, but he raw, bro. No, nah, he cold. Who Cooper flag? Yeah. No, nah, he cold. I ain't. No, nah, I'm not knocking. Nah, you, no, you no, no, you're not knocking him. But I'm saying though, either pick you get, you okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm not knocking. Ace Bailey yeah, cold. Okay. Cooper flag cold. I ain't, I ain't knocking. I'm just yeah. saying, like, it, he has the potential to be better than Cooper Flag. For sure. But I'm not saying Cooper Flag not going to no, no, be a no, star. No, 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 you ain't saying that. I'm at saying all. they both can be. This draft class is like the draft class people was waiting for. Facts, yeah. bro. So, you know what I mean? So, and well, I harvest something special. I didn't know he was like that. I caught him in, uh, I know I'll be fucking with the AAU, but. Nah, he he liked that. He liked that for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I watched the Arkansas game versus Kansas, um, and DJ Wagner come back to school was a great decision. Nah, nah, he looked way more comfortable. Like, I can see him having a big year. I can see him probably being a late first round pick. So, yeah, that's. And, like, a lot of things people were talking about, it was like, you know, when we talked about it with Miles, like, jumping after we ready or then, you know what I'm saying, waiting another year, it's a hell of a gamble. But in people, his situation and a lot of people's situation, sometimes if them one and done just came back to school one year, I get it, go get that bread. But if you had one more year where you could just show your full capabilities, you may not get typecasted when you get drafted. Yeah, he wasn't going to get drafted. In the first round, oh uh, no, nah, he he needed to go back to school. Yeah, I don't even he, think it was an option he, for him he, to teeter. They said yeah. it, but there was no reason for him to go. Nah, to he the made post. he made the best decision going back to school. And I think he's way more comfortable in a situation that he know he can flourish in. I think he gonna have a big big year.